have the CEO of Embl. Okay. It's spelled M B L, which stands for Mass Vehicle Ledger. That's right. Um, this is Kate Wu. Thank you for your time today. Nice to meet you, Akane. <laughs> um, please tell us about your company. Okay, so uh, Embl uh, started this blockchain business uh, like last end of last year. So, but we've been in the uh, mobility industry for about four years. But even before that, actually, we started our startup for six years ago, like 2012. Mm -hmm. So we had uh, several experience of uh, social networking project, location-based service, and then we enter into mobility business for four years of business of making platform or fleet management system, reservation management system, and then. We learned that the blockchain could be the one that we can actually solve the current existing problems of vendors and drivers. So that's why we started this blockchain business uh, by the end of last year. Mm -hmm. Okay, so um, what I understand about your project is you give value to um, things such as like you know driving safe right. or um, like repairs mm -hmm. and you know for like when you buy like used cars mm. you see like credibility right, and right. things like that. Can mm. you explain a little bit more? So uh, Embel Protocol is the, the first mission of Embel Protocol is to connect those uh, mobility business platforms on top of this Embel Protocol. but. Uh, when we talk about the mobility service, it actually connected with the whole car related service. So it's not just about the car, it could be the bike. Any mobility service can be connected on top of this. So very first example will be on-demand service. On-demand service could be uh, realizable on top of blockchain uh, protocol. So, and then um, used coupler. So when we talk about blockchain project, uh, used car platform is the very first example because used car selling market is very level market. Nobody can trust each other of their data. So whenever they purchase the car, they want to see the data of the uh, history data of the car they are going to buy. But some country uh, does not even provide the local uh, the history of the car, and some country even they provide the report of the data. Sometimes it's a demo car. So within the blockchain uh, uh, protocol, when you uh, repair your car, when you drive your car, it records onto the block and nobody can change it, mm -hmm. nobody can delete it. Mm -hmm. So with that data, people can actually create that trustworthy uh, transaction each other. Mm -hmm. So that's one of the examples that we try to create. Mm -hmm. So Emble is the, the protocol that uh, can build the trust between the interaction of uh, customers and drivers and sellers and buyers mm -hmm. with within the mobility industry. Mm -hmm. So blockchain technology sounds perfect for your project. Yes, yeah, it is. So uh, we, we, we found that uh, blockchain as a service is a very perfect solution that we can solve all those uh, known problems that we have faced before. Mm -hmm. so for example, rental companies they are actually suffering from uh, like uh, deducting the commission and the beating price of war between the other companies. So they have to sacrifice that, otherwise they cannot earn money, so they will die. So even, even if they can participate in the platform, they still sacrifice their commission. So that doesn't help their business to grow actually. And also some of them, most of them in, let's say in Asian countries, the, the small scale of rent company does not even have a system to manage. So all those kind of problems can be uh, actually solved with the blockchain uh, incentive system that we try to build. So we give more incentive to them and we give like your permission service to them and also we give additional asset which is the Embo point that they can earn. So all these kind of package that we can actually solve those uh, known problems. Okay, um, sounds like a great service. Like I'm <laughs> right? sure a lot of people want to use it. Mm -hmm. um, is it already available or? So uh, now uh, we are uh, we have our fleet management system already been uh, built and up and running, and uh, this blockchain protocol is on the process of development. Uh, on top of Ethereum, or we're building uh, this uh, application protocol. We, 
end and we call this is the test net period mm -hmm. so uh, after we test the all things by the end of this year and we're going to release our first version of mainnet uh, beginning of next year mm -hmm. so then uh, more partners can participate into Ember protocol and they can enjoy like zero commission service and also they can take more benefit throughout mm -hmm. this okay so you say your platform is on ethereum like mm -hmm. is there a specific reason why you so um so ethereum would be the the very well known uh, protocol so that anybody can use it mm -hmm. and it's very easy to uh, communicate with the individual users when we use the Ethereum. And also, the process of our uh, ICO, it makes us very easy to uh, do the crowdfunding from our general public. Mm -hmm. So if, for example, if we use our like, other platform not well known for now, then if we try to raise uh, from the crowd, people may not have that uh, token so we cannot be we cannot actually uh, raise more fun and also ethereum uh, it's been developed for quite long years so people know that how to use it so there are many user cases that we can actually review and learn from them so that's why we choose it mm -hmm. okay thank you um so you are based in Korea? Right, that's right. Okay. So our whole team actually is an international team. So main developers and design team and operation team is in Seoul. And we have one operation team in Japan, in Tokyo. Mm -hmm. And we have one team in Singapore and one team in uh, Vietnam. Mm -hmm. So these four countries are strategically uh, very important for us to expand and build for mm -hmm. Is there a reason why you're working with like those teams from different countries? Uh, it's, it's because, uh, like I said, uh, strategically, uh, Singapore is very important. So when we introduced the blockchain-based ride-hailing service, Singapore would be the perfect market that we can test it. And the timing of uh, launching the service is also perfect right now because of the monopoly situation of ride-hailing service in Southeast Asia. So that gave us uh, perfect chance to penetrate the market with the concept of blockchain and with the concept of non-profit with the concept of giving all the benefit to the drivers and the customers okay. so based on that so we definitely need the team members in that region singapore and vietnam mm -hmm. and also japan is a little bit different so mm -hmm. on-demand service is not working well here but all those mobility mobility related business like uh, youth car service and all, all other platforms like up and running really well so mm -hmm. we can connect with them mm -hmm. so we can help them to convert their business to, with the blockchain based business mm -hmm. okay so you um you hope to expand your business to like internationally in the yes. future yeah so uh, this Ember project started in Singapore. So Singapore will be the first market that we are introducing blockchain-based service, and Vietnam will be the next, and Korea and Japan also the next. But currently, we are focusing on uh, Asia market. So Southeast Asia, five countries: Indonesia, uh, Singapore, Vietnam, Malaysia, and Thailand. In uh, Northeast Asia, China, Hong Kong, Taiwan, Japan, Korea. But among them, the Korea and Japan is the most important country. And in Southeast Asia, it's the Singapore and Vietnam is the most important country. Okay, great, thank you. Um, so where can we find you? I mean, the information about your project? Uh, so information about our project is on our website. It's at mbl, M-B-L, chain, C-H-A-I-N, dot I-O. Mm -hmm. So uh, you can find the information of our uh, project and you can find the information about the our on-demand service. So yeah, so come to our website and you can find information about okay. that. Okay, great. Thank you so much, Gary. Right. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you very much.